Hey YouTube, this is Lynn, and I just like to go over some products that I use a lot today. Pretty much, this is going to be like a makeup review uh, video. <laughs> There's no tutorial here. So, um, to start off, some of my favorite things that I like to use all the time. Um, one thing I do use for my face, which can be worn alone or be worn over liquid foundation, is the Mineralize MAC Skin Finish Natural, or it's made by MAC. Um, I just put it on with a regular powder brush. And this stuff goes on and has a pretty good coverage. Um, a lot comes in it for a real good price. Um, probably one of the only MAC products you'll ever see me use. And it gives a really good full coverage for just a powder using it on its own. Um, if I don't use this on its own and I'm putting it over something, I use it with my Sephora liquid foundation. Now this Sephora liquid foundation, really good liquid foundation. It has um, a medium to, or light to medium coverage and um, you can build on it but I usually, like I said before in my earlier tutorials, I don't like really building on makeup too much. So um, this is the Sephora color. I am a D25 because I have the uh, yellow gold undertones in my skin. So this is by Sephora. This is how much comes in it. It's about $20. It's pretty good. Um, what else do I use for my face? I like for my blush, I use um, a Victoria's Secret blush that um, I got for my sister a while back. And um, the only brushes that I'm really into, because I don't really use brushes, obviously you guys hardly ever see me use them, are brushes by um, Sonia Kashuk. Hopefully I'm pronouncing her last na name right. They have a really good blush brush, and it looks like this comes in a little, um, usually this brush always comes in their um, makeup brush kits, like they have kits you can buy at Target or you can buy online. Really good brushes, the bristles don't fall out or anything and last for a while. And as far as my face primer goes, I use the Revlon Beyond Natural Foundation Primer. Um, like I said, I do compare it to the Smashbox Primer because for me it works the same, but it's a lot cheaper. <laughs> so you want to save money. Next is our Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. This is a really good, 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 good base. There's this color and they also have one that comes in like a bluey purple um, little container. This one is the um, champagne colored one. It has a light champagne tint to it. It's nothing that you'll see over your eyeshadow. Obviously, you can't see it. <laughs> I always use my Revlon um, Liquid Liner. I can never pronounce it right. Every time I'm trying to tell you guys what I'm using, I always mix it up. It's the uh, Revlon Color Stay Liquid Liner, and it's the um, metallic black. I don't like using the regular black because it just looks too harsh. It With the uh, metallic and the shimmery, it just works with the sun and everything. It just makes your eyes come out a lot more. And let me show you what the point looks like. Even after time, it still has a pretty good point you can see there. And I mean, with people who have any shaky hand problem or anything when it comes to liquid liner, I think this works really good. My mascara is the L'Oreal Hip Mascara, just regular black. I think this works really well to lift up your lashes after you've curled them, and it's not hard to take off, but it won't come off when you're crying or anything, so it's like not one of those difficult mascaras to take off. I really love this one. My favorite eyeshadows are by Ben Nye. This is probably my favorite eyeshadow. It's this purple one, so you can see here. And they are pretty pigmented. Let's see if my light will catch this. I'm just putting a little on. And oh, let's see. Oh, no, you can't see it. the light too much. I can see it, but with the way the light is, you can't really. Maybe I can get it on a little darker. You can kind of see it. It's just the lighting's bad in here. But these Ben Nye eyeshadows, great price for a lot of eyeshadow. So remember Ben Nye. My favorite eyeliner is the L'Oreal, again, the hip liner. This is what I always use on the bottom, this coal liner. This stuff never comes off, I swear on it. If you're crying or sweating or doing whatever throughout the day, this, um, this is a liner that you never, ever, ever have to touch up on. So remember that, the L'Oreal hip um, coal eyeliner. I also love my little Smashbox eyeshadows. I know you probably won't see this because of the lighting in here either, but I'll try to put this next to the orange. I still can't see it too well. Can you see it on my finger? 
that's what it looks like. It's orange. And there's the purple. And that's my phone going off. Let me silence that real quick. <laughs> so, remember Smashbox. Smashbox, great eyeshadows. And that's about it. If you want me to do any more makeup reviews or if you have any questions, let me know. Thanks.